Hey everybody, welcome back. We're back with more, um, Dead Rising. The Adventures of Capcom Butt, or the recently stripped Capcom Butt. Because we can't seem to keep our costume on for one episode anymore. <clears throat> but I've had just about enough of that, so guess what we're gonna do? That's right! We're gonna take the freaking Mega Buster and shove it up their freaking ass! I've had just about enough of their nonsense, and I'm gonna end this. I know I said it to go the whole playthrough without using the Mega Buster, but... You know what? No. I'm not gonna use the Mega Buster. If I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this proper. I know there's a couple of you out there that are clamoring for me to use the Mega Buster. But no, Capcom Butt don't play that. But apparently he does play drunk and not able to climb up some of the racks. Frickin' Capcom, Capcom Butt begins back in episode. Six. <laughs> this would be kind of like a Capcom butt rises. Break the freaking box, dumbass. There we go. Now, let's see. How the heck am I going to pull this one off? I mean, it's not like there's combo weapons. And the entrance plaza is really the only place nearby that has this big umbrella, so I can't just push through a large group of people. Hmm. Yeah. That's the wrong one. <laughs> there we go. Otis, my handy butler! The only person whom I trust with my secret identity. Otis is like my Alfred. I finish up this delicious Mountain Dew. Man, nobody's really signed in this time. I guess I found the perfect time for people to not be online on Sundays. <clears throat> oh, I forgot the bat. Oh, I got a hammer now. We'll call it the Hammer du Justusio. Justusio! That's not even a language. On the Grim Reaper. On the Grim Reaper. On the Grim Reaper. On the Grim Reaper. I'm griefing all this. I'm, I'm griefing all this Grim. Arrgh! Man, zombies are freaking hams. <laughs> oh man, if only I could. I would like do this next part. I want to do it just to like, queue up. But I'm sorry, but I don't want to get trouble. So Now I showed you that this was up here in episode like four. If that, it might have even been sooner. Come on. Of course I can't get to it. There we go. Capcom Butt's mojo was stolen. See, Capcom Butt's power decreases the more people who know who he is. Yeah, that road that will do that. <laughs> Shut up! God, you're worse than spaz. And of course, we're gonna have to get a katana because 
Right after those guys, I have to fight their leader. Jeez. Eh, screw it. We need the katana. Excuse me. I have a hand. I will, however, be getting my flashlight. It's not in this door. It's in this door. True story, I used to have a, uh, a pair of shorts just like that. Yeah. Except that, uh, they were a darker blue and they were jeans. But just like that, otherwise. Shut up, Sensor Town! Oh, I'm so I'm really so glad when those assholes are gone. Is there a propane tank over here? Ooh, no, but there's soda. What? What was that? You guys hear that? Is that me? No, it wasn't me. Abbott. Recommended beverage? Untouchable. Alright then. Did that happen the last time we were here? Get away, you prick! Oh, crap. Sodas! <laughs> Alright, we're working out. We're almost done here. Alright. I like it, I'm happy. We've got a freaking chance. Ugh. We might have all our revenge in one battle. Give me that. Mega Buster! Sweet! I didn't want to use it, but here it is. Suck Mega Bolts! Maybe it was a fluke. Crap. It's a toy! Oh man. There we go. Eat refreshing beverage! Here we go. You there, evil dress wearing Pat Robertson clone. You've stolen my identity oh, one too many times. Salvation. What? I'm talking. Embrace ignorance. You're about to embrace deadness. Yeah. That's right. You gonna move? Oh, a sword. Kiss my ass, I have a hammer. No, I... shall return your tainted blood you to the foul... You took my bloody taint? You. I'm a superhero. I wasn't spawned of the Earth. Comodo servo exeverto. What? Victory! Now will you turn over a new leaf, Mr. Pat Robertson? 
I'll give you one chance. Oh, I'm lying. I'll just kill you. So, you know. Whatever you want. Oh, right in the eye! Oh. Ew. This would be a bad time for your mom to walk, walk in if you were playing this game. Well, wonder if you saw that coming. <laughs> uh -oh. You guys want to mess with me? Nope, I killed your patriarch. You guys are screwed. Brainwashing Don't let it get away. Gotta find out what that does. No, get off. Well, that guy survived it, no problem. Sweet. Are you all right? What? I missed one. Oh, it's okay. He's just praying. Are you all right? Don't worry, guys. I'll save you. I am Capcom Bot. Thanks. Are you all right? Ray Matheson. Man, these guys are complaining about marks on their skin from the ropes. Imagine how pissed off they're gonna be when I kill them. Sorry, I had the wrong button. Are you alright? Son of a bitch. I'm leaving. Nathan Crab. With me and Harry Potter. Magneto, welcome to die. I killed her. I spotted a guy with long hair over in one of the women's sure. clothing shapes and long relaying plaza. Let's hold a Molotov cocktail. You better be careful. Alright, I'm just gonna kill this guy. There we go. They're all dead. I killed every one of them. Ah, it feels good to be a dickhead. Hmm, 13 minutes, 49 seconds. I don't have much else to say. This could potentially be bad. Alright, mannequin on stage with a bunch of cabbages. There's a sledgehammer, I'd say that was a reference to Gallagher. They kind of missed, they kind of dropped the ball on that one. That's okay. Maybe there's another entertainer who juggles cabbages, and that's a reference to that. Alright, I picked up a book called Brainwashing Tactics. Escorted survivors no longer fear death and will jump in danger. Okay, well, I don't need that.
As very useful as that book is for some of the runs where you save a lot of people, not so much if you're not entirely worried about their safety. Another one of those respawning weapons. Like I said earlier, some of the weapons you get from Psychopaths will pick them up on the ground and uh, they'll respawn if you leave the area and come back. But I can't see any possible reason you would have to ever come back to this area ever again, so we're just gonna ignore that one. But hey, on the upside, it's daytime and I no longer have to worry about my secret identity being outed. Because the yellow coats are nowhere around here. And this place is really creepy for some reason. Maybe it's because I don't usually listen too closely when I'm playing, but every time I hear like a bunch of zombies growling at once now, it's actually because, you know, I'm wearing my headphones so you guys don't hear it in the background of the uh, vocal recording, commentary recording, but uh, yeah. The leading cause of death in an actual zombie apocalypse is boredom. And this game definitely suit or definitely hammers that point home. There are some large chunks of this game where you don't have anything to do. Damn it! Think, oh. You okay? You okay, Captain Butt? You big hairy man, you? There are large chunks of this game where you don't have anything. This being one of them. One of the actually one of the longer ones, too. As it goes for freaking eight hours. And it looks to me like we've only gone five. Let's see. Start at four. Yeah, it's actually only been four hours. We're halfway there. Whoa! Ah! We're halfway there! Whoa! Living on a prayer! Chop, 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 there's a guy hanging out in the cosmetic shop in Wonderland Plaza. He don't look so good. Eh, well, let's go kill him. A sick man. Oh man, I want to. I want to make a song for you guys. I think I'll. I think I'll do that next episode. Well, not next episode, but next time I uh, sit down, maybe slap it up on iTunes if I can. I've been rolling through it in my head recently. I kind of want to do it. Oh, that's right. He's over here. Cosmetic shop. Leroy! Shink a magoon. <sighs> Oh man, Leroy. You are so dead. Leroy McKenna. Alright. Well, it looks like. Wait, don't I run into a guy named something McKenna in the next game? I wonder if they're related. Hmm. Well, anyway, that's about 20 minutes, so... Next episode, we will... Uh, go to the next part of the storyline. 
There's where all that stuff over there is. And... Yeah. We'll get ever closer to finishing this game. Actually, uh, I think we might actually be really close. Even though I can't remember what day it is. Hmm. I think it's day two. Might be day three, though. Go to the urinal. <laughs> I forgot about that. Oh, man. All right. Catch you guys next time. Bye.